The human eye is filled with a liquid extracellular matrix called a vitreous. In the mouse eye, this space is mostly filled by the lens. To isolate the vitreous and retina, we first have to dissect the anterior segment. Stabilize the eye with forceps and use a super sharp blade to make a single incision across the cornea. A dull blade can tear the cornea and require a few strokes. A wet cell sponge is used to absorb fluid in the anterior chamber. The arrows show where we'll squeeze the lens and vitreous out with forceps. Partially close the forceps and pull forward. The lens looks like a clear sphere and trailing behind it will be the vitreous gel. In this example, the vitreous remains adherent to the back of the lens. To isolate the retina, forceps are placed further back near the optic nerve. Squeeze gently and pull forward, the retina appears like a yellow gelatinous material. In some cases the retina, vitreous, and lens will come out as a single tissue. The next step is to isolate and separate these three tissues using a filter centrifugation device. The filter piece goes in the top of an Eppendorf tissue.